I want to draw your attention to an interesting question I came across last week. What's so good about the lines being in charge? In a great piece over on movie, Kelly Dong looks at the underlying portrayal of good and evil in kids' films, focusing on the Lion King. Dong's premise is that villains being evil just for the sake of being evil, and that that evilness being represented through a cliched appearance and facial expressions, gives children little opportunity to understand the motivations of others. In The Lion King, the lions being in charge is seen as the natural way of things, and restoring them to being in charge is seen as a noble goal. But why is this a good deal for the other animals? Why are the hyenas evil just for wanting access to the good hunting grounds the lions keep for themselves? Now I'm sure some of you are saying this is thinking about a kid's film a bit too deeply. It is a story about a man's struggle with his own homosexuality. That's it. That is what Top Gun is about, man. But the stories we tell kids can't help but affect the way they see the world and how it should work. There's much more in the article than I've mentioned here, including a study on how superhero films affect the kids that watch them. I recommend checking it out. And on a sad note, I've just come across a story this morning on the bankruptcy of Annapurna Pictures. It's a real shame to see a company that put out so many good independent films unable to stay afloat. I'll link to the article and perhaps go into it in more detail in a future episode.